Hello students, welcome to the new YouTube channel Easy Learning. In this video, you are going to learn 12th standard syllabus computer application. Before entering into 12th standard, let me have a recap what we what you have learnt in your 11th standard. In your 11th standard, you have learnt two volumes of books, volume 1 and volume 2. In volume 1, you are having, you had two units. In unit 1, fundamentals of computer. Unit 2, office automation tools like Word, spreadsheet, presentation. It's nothing but your MS Office Word, Excel, PowerPoint. In the third unit, you have learnt HTML and CSS. Fourth unit, JavaScript. Fifth unit, computer ethics. And in the sixth unit, Tamil computing. So in the first unit, it's a very easy topic as, you, as many of them have learnt in their lower class itself. The new concept here is only the number system. Regarding the second unit, those who have used the system regularly for typing a letter or doing some help for your parent or it, it will be easy. But for the newcomers, it will be very interesting to learn the Word, Excel and the PowerPoint presentation. In the third unit, you have learned HTML and CSS. I hope it's really an interesting chapter because you can change the font color, you can change the background, you can add image, you can give background music, you can even add a video in your web page. Really, it's a very interesting unit. In the fourth unit, you have learned JavaScript scripting. As up to me, some of the students may felt this unit as a tough because of introduction of programming. In the sixth, fifth and sixth unit, computer ethics and computer security, Tamil computing. Both units are general topic and both are very easy. So on, on the 11th standard, we will have an idea that it is having units and these are the titles. Uh, the thing is you have learned 223 plus 200, nearly 450 pages in your 11th standard book. Even though it is 450 pages, but you may not felt that it is a big book when compared with your accounts commerce. Let's see what is in your 12th standard computer application book. This is the content page of your book. It's nearly having 18 chapters as of your 11th standard. But see the page number. It is nearly 267, 76 pages, nearly 276 pages. Is it, is it less right when compared with your 11th standard? Because in your 11th standard, you have learned nearly 450 pages. But in 12th standard, you are going to learn only, through, only 276 pages. I hope it is a good news for you. But the content, there is no splitting of units in your 12th standard. Directly, they have given only the top chapters from 1 to 18. So, I will give you an idea. That means, how you can split your content page. First, chapter 1 and chapter 2 in one unit. And chapter 3 in a separate unit. In chapter 4 to chapter 9 as a separate unit. Chapter 10 to 14 as separate unit. And chapter 15 to 18 as separate unit. This is my idea. So, the first two chapters we can have a title as multimedia the unit next database management system dbms next unit is one two three four five six six chapters together we can label it as php programming because this is the introduction of php and this is the connectivity of php and mysql then we can label the chapter 10 to 12, 12 to 14 as networking. Then the 15th to 18th chapter or e-commerce. Really, it is a good chapter or good chapters and it is a useful unit for the real time working. 
I'll give my idea that we can split the 18 chapters in this way. Chapter 1 and 2 as one unit. Chapter 3 as separate unit. Chapter 4 to 9 separate unit. Chapter 10 to 14 separate unit. Chapter 15 to 18 separate unit. That means chapter 1 and 2 together we can call it as multimedia. Chapter 3 as DBMS and chapter 4 to 9 together we can label it as PHP programming. Chapter 4 is the introduction to PHP programming and chapter 9 is the connectivity between PHP and MySQL. All the six chapters are PHP related chapters so we can have it as a separate unit. Then chapter 10 to 14 we can label it as networking. Chapter 15 to 18 we can label it as e-commerce. So now you may look it's a easy thing that you are having five units and this 12th standard computer application. In this unit multimedia, multimedia and desktop publishing, introduction to Adobe PageMaker. That means a general topic of multimedia and desktop publishing and one of the example of desktop publishing software. It is simply known as DTP software Adobe PageMaker. You are going to learn in theory as well as in practicals. In practical, you are going to have four exercises from this lesson alone. It is really uh, interesting and easy chapters for everyone. Then DBMS. After learning DBMS, we can learn PHP. Then only we can do the ninth chapter PHP MySQL connections. Then networking. These are all only theory concept. And the last one e-commerce will be a theory, theoretical concept. But Many practical things are involved here. So after coming to this chapter, we will, you will learn to, uh, you will learn many things. Oh, this is said to be electronic payment. I know this. I am using this. My parent is using this. Likewise, you will have many ideas. So feel happy and your 12th standard computer application is really easy thing. But how? in your mind that you should have some much concentration and hard work to crack high marks because it's not that much easy with your 11th standard but you can really get good marks even you can score center marks if you do your hard work all the best children so thank you for watching this channel easy learning so subscribe this channel to watch the upcoming videos. Thank you. Have a good day.